You know, life is like a cigarette. It's hot, but it's, and there's a lot of smoke. But when you've puffed your final puff, the high's over and that's all. But if you're a smoker, you can always buy a new pack, can't you? <laughs> I'll have another life in God, you know! <laughs> I want, I'll have another go! I'm addicted! <laughs> Don't really like staying alive! <laughs> uh, God says if you smoke too much, you have cancer! <laughs> oh, life's bad for the health! <laughs> Depends what you do with it. <laughs> Dang, I'm crapping on. For example, if you fornicate with wolves, there's certain venereal diseases you'll get. Oh, right, I won't fornicate with wolves. Go back to the Nazis, <laughs> the Germans. <laughs> the bestiality in Germany, I've heard. <laughs> Read that online. Popular there. But it's popular everywhere. <laughs> Some people are really crude. <laughs> But it's only a tiny percentage of your interaction animal sex. <laughs> In the Bible, in Leviticus 18 and 20, Egypt was guilty of animal sex. <laughs> Jeez, you'd, you'd have to be desperate, you know. <laughs> you sort of been on your own for four years and suddenly notice a dog. <laughs> Yeah, maybe. <laughs> when you, 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 you're high and dry Saturday night and the mates are fucked off and you're going, yeah, yeah, dingo, yeah, uh, I'll think about it. <laughs> That's a sorry romance, isn't it? 